Oh no, no. It's pause again. So god, level 13, man, what? Yeah. Guys, this is the last game for tonight, because after this I will be dead. Dead, 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 dead. This is like the former... Oh god, oh god, level 13, man, what? Used to be level 12 till a minute ago. God. Um, former world champion and uh, I think currently also one of the top guys, top dogs. Second place, first place, I don't know. But the boss is insane, man. Out of this world. He's uh, like on one line with Mock, pretty much. Don't tell him I said that. <laughs> He's second right now, okay, yeah, yeah. Second of the world, holy cow. That's gonna be a tough one. Um. Oh, well, let's say hi, first of all. Um, yeah, I'm going for that base. Let's just hope I never get moved up. Mm, I would prefer to go for this one as it's closer to, to the side here. So the projectiles, projectiles don't fly that long. But uh, yeah, this makes a big difference first last season though yeah yeah he has the gold crown so he was um first place and now he's second so hmm, yeah he's definitely one of the top dogs so if i beat him then um i'll call it the night either way if i lose or win but yeah he's hard i did beat him before but very hard to beat this frost is out of this world Currently the frost is a little bit blocked, uh, that's what they say, it, um, even though it doesn't have a snowflake, it still triggers the, um, the talent, where is it? Uh, oh, it doesn't even have that one. Mm, okay, interesting. Well, in that case, nice, good to know. No. Um, There you go. Just need to be super careful because it freezes all my units all the time. It's so hard. Oh yeah, yeah. Did not get shaman, but I had free Harlequin. Yeah, um, Frankenstein. I would never upgrade Harlequin right now. I mean, the four percent less damage whenever you make copy is decent but um, if you don't have a max level damage dealer unit um, I would upgrade the damage dealer unit first before you go for Harlequin because on a damage dealer unit you normally get at least um, 10 and uh, sometimes even till 25% more raw stats on the unit per level upgrade so that's a huge deal way more than the 4% on the Harlequin Yeah. Whenever Harlequin gets stacked, uh, st um, talent. We talk again, but <laughs> for now. Oh, wow. Okay. He does even more damage now, thanks to Witch. That's new, actually. I haven't seen him play this version of the deck yet. Curious, curious. Technically, he can do even more damage than the last time I fought him, so gonna be a tough one. I try to keep my board full, as full as I can, so he doesn't have less chance to hit this guy. And finally, nice. Mm. I need some stacks for now. I know it's a little bit early for that, but is what it is. 
just don't want to get moved. Please don't freeze me. Please don't freeze me before the pop of your arrives. That would be devastating. But yeah, I have to take risks because uh, he's will give me a hard time anyway. Yo, thanks for the follow, my man, Dr. Frankenstein. Are you from the Dark Raven clan, by the way? The DR clan? No, no, just what I feared. Come on, let him go, let him go, yes, okay, ooh. Ay, 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 god. This virus doesn't harm me too much, so I'll get my stacks here as long as I can. Seven. Oh yeah, that's a great lock game for tonight. Doesn't matter if I win or lose, but it's always a pleasure to play against boss. He's such a monster, man. Oh god, that's a big, that was a big risk. Shouldn't have done that. But yeah, I need so much damage to keep up with this guy. That's just insane. So I have to go all in or take risks uh, that I wouldn't normally take. Turned them into crystals, nice, nice. What clan? Uh, the Dark Raven clan. There is a, call, a clan called PR, just like Dr. Frankenstein. And uh, they call themselves the Orc, but uh, yeah, it's a um, very, very strong A to win clan. So, it would surprise me if you were a member of them if you don't have Dormen yet. Oh, yeah, let's go. Okay, okay. That's great, man. We just need uh, one year five golden ride on this guy, then we're maxed out. We need to hope that he doesn't hit my guy with his sword. We need to hope he doesn't hit my guy with his uh, frost. So yeah, pretty much uh, get this bad, bad boy on our Inquisitor and pray. So that's pretty much it. Mmm, dry it. And as soon as I have this one on tier 7, I will make a big clock board. I already forgot that I'm playing clock again. I thought I'm still with the sharpshooter because I played sharpshooter all night, so. Mm. Yeah. All right. Mm, we have the 10 merges. Let's take the risks. No, man, seriously. I don't want it. Okay, perfect. I do want that. Perfect, perfect. Oh, nice. Another one. Um, let's put that one into a, a tier 3 clock. We got a tier 5. Let's do this and this. Oh, 
me up. I won't drop another one because if it's a if it's a inquisitor, I'm screwed. Just wait for this to leave and hope the best. Hope that it hits uh, anything hardcore on his side. No, it's my version of Dr. Frankenstein. Okay, interesting. Yeah, cool. Yeah, it's a, it's a cool name though. Frankenstein. A little bit of Eminem inside of it. Is book worth it on level 10 Inquisitor? Nope, it's not. Or should I stick when the rule and only use it on 30 plus? You can use it on 12 plus, actually. Because um, from 12 to 13, you need three units on the, to level up. Like three legendaries. And that's the maximum. So for even from, from 14 to 15, you only need three legendaries. And the nine crystals, so it, that that doesn't change. Starting from twelve, it doesn't change anymore. So, um, whenever you use a book for any unit above twelve, twelve, um, it's fine. You won't miss out on anything. So yeah, we just wait to twelve. Don't need to wait to thirty. Just make a difference. I uh, pay a little bit less gold, but yeah, it's uh, not even worth mentioning really. So we have, I hope I kill them quick enough so they don't, yeah, I do, perfect. Ah, man. Yeah, we have a lot of clocks, but obviously it's still not enough yet. Yes, all right, all right, that's what we're talking about. Um, just get rid of this guy, please. I have so many clocks. Oh, nice, nice. Oh man, not again. Please just give me another clock. Please, please, please. Yeah. Against Bob, I need to have gold parries like mad, I need to completely fill my board with clocks, it's uh, super, super hard. But in this case, yeah, I finally got the clock board, yeah, let's go! Woo! In this case, I can even win games against him, but other than that, man, it's so crazy. And to be fair, uh, the thing that he does with this deck uh, is super hard to pull off he needs a lot of time to merge enough witches to get the additional buff and everything if he manages though he can i don't know go on forever pretty much yes but it's it takes a long time to pull this off and i try not to give him this time by giving him time you know what i mean <laughs> but uh yeah i don't not sure if this is enough, to be honest. I mean, look at this board, man. My clock is maxed. I have 13 clocks on the board. Even tier 5s. Two tier 5 clocks. And he's still in the game. It's so ridiculous, man. Like, uh, most of... Like, any other, pretty much, they would... Uh, do it in super slow motion so they would just die in a damage compilation like that and it's a tier 5 inquisitor if you know what i mean so holy cow man yes let's go good game boss good game man Whew. damn that was very 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 close yeah i love our games so as this one is once again going to YouTube, sorry, it's like the first video against you boss doing on uh, that, that I put on YouTube, but games against you are always so hard. They are exciting and everything, so it's really super content creator material. Big shout out to you, man, and uh, thanks for the games. And finally, 1-1 again, yay! 
Check out the Rosh Royale market to bring your account to the next level. Simply enter your Rosh Royale ID and use my secret code GodlikeMike. You can also send gems, battle passes and platinum to a friend's account if you want to help somebody get some legendaries. 10 winners will be drawn at the end of every month. Each of them will get rewarded with $10 worth of platinum straightly sent on his or her account. Please just don't forget to send me your Rosh Royale ID in the message box so I can send you the platinum whenever you get lucky on the giveaway. I'm live on Twitch every Saturday and I will also do the giveaway live always on the last Saturday of the month. Thanks a lot for your great support and good luck on the giveaway. Slap that subscribe button, thank you very much and see you on the next video.